All right, so we got people are horny for Atomic Hot Robot Twins, not me. Let's get right to Atomic Heart is one of the most hyped game releases of 2023. It is, it After is. After being announced way back in 2017, the slick trailers and shrouded details regarding what it's actually like finally gave way to a concrete launch. And, as it would turn out, much of it is just really, really horny. Of course, these two Not robot me. characters, often described as the ballerina twins, feature in-game, giving gamers a taste of forbidden fruit in the form of sexualized machinery. At least, that's how they've been interpreted by millions, as evidenced Not by me. extensive fan art and meme culture focusing on their exploits. Not I. We've got entire videos dedicated to the oh death animations God. generated by the twins, with questionable comments surrounding them. I mean, just take a look at the video thumbnails and titles covering the two <laughs> robots. The vibe feels a lot like the introduction of Lady Dimitrescu during the release of Nah, bro, Evil nah. 8, Lady Dimitrescu, bro, bro, she got it. Worse. For that tall, tall lady. She Plus, got Atomic it worse, for its imaginative world design They was calling her all types pieces, of mommy and everything, criticism bro. about wonky dialogue manifesting in suggestions to play the game in its native Russian audio with English subtitles have appeared. And, unfortunately, a fair chunk of the game's reputation is being discussed regarding the fact that the devs, Munfish, are Russian, which yeah. may lead to some profits going to the Russian government. PC Gamer notes that if anything, the game satirizes and pokes fun at Soviet exceptionalism instead of endorsing it. However, Ukraine has also officially asked to remove Atomic Heart from storefronts in their country. Makes so sense, it's quite yeah. clear the game is ruffling sense. some feathers. Plus, Mick Gordon, the composer of Doom's soundtrack, has donated his fee for composing Atomic Heart's soundtrack to the Red Cross's Ukraine Crisis Appeal. Oh, that's nice, As he started man. working on the game way back in 20. 20 Shout out to him, bro. Kicked off in 2022. So, as you can see, despite a ton of horny postings surrounding the game's release, <laughs> it would appear Atomic Heart isn't without its fair share of controversy. Clearly, the art style and visual treats provided by Munfish are the best aspect of the game, as demonstrated by this love for the twins overshooting praise for combat or storytelling. That's not to say it's being reviewed as a bad game. It's Critics a good and game. Audiences are like in my it opinion, it's a good Heart game. Very good scores. It's just unfortunate that it has been hyped up as something industry dominating as Bioshock. Yeah. If nothing else, the game has clearly spawned love due to its personality for better or for worse it's, and that it's, is it's very that it's very weird years. that's it this is very short, weird the robot twins from atomic heart are receiving horniness on a massive scale proving the developers knew what they were doing one way or another with one of the most <laughs> anticipated game releases of 2023 what meme would you guys like me to give a lesson in next let me know in the comments that's it, below that's it, that's it, that's remember, like and subscribe <laughs> 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 Or else. He's not talking to me <laughs> in real life. He's not. I'm joking. I've already liked the video. Um, other than that, let me just say something. This game, it wasn't as down bad as Resident Evil, bro. They had uh, Lady Dimitri. Is that Lady Dimitres or, or or Lady Mommy? Right. In other words, not not for me. A lot of people were calling her all types of mommy, whatever. I was calling her Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, bro. She had she had the height of Kevin Durant, bro. That's what I was calling her. I wasn't, you know, me. See, see, I'm not going to do that. You meet a guy like me. I'm not going to. Oh, oh, my gosh. Can I get to the game? I'm not going to. I'm not going to. I'm not going to say none of that, you know, but at the end of the day, I see what the devs are doing. Um, <laughs> when they made these two robots, I, 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 I don't know. What are you going to say, right? If we was to get the devs from Atomic Heart, right? The person that made these robots, right? If we was to just, you know, get them on an interview, right? And I was to ask them, okay, what was the, like, what was the, what was the design for these robots? Why did you make them, you know, why did you make the robots the robots? Like, why did you, how did, why did you make them in like that certain, you know, size and that matter and stuff like that? Like, you know, certain, you know. Uh, wh why? What do you think the dev is going to say? What do you think they're going to say? And, you know, and they, and if they say, you know, I don't want to answer that question or I plead the fifth or, you know, some or something like that. I 1000 percent accept it <laughs> because questions like that shouldn't we, we, we should we honestly we should really just be playing the game and just not asking any questions. Cause I don't have a problem with it, but that's just me. Comment down below if you guys have a problem with this. Uh, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys like my reaction. Other than that, I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out. That was a good intro. That was a good, solid, little, flowy, little, just nice, just little flowing intro. And. <laughs>